Hello and welcome to today's video. Today I'll be bringing you a quick guide on how to get the Godskin's Prayer Book and the Godslayer's Seal. These are some very, very good incantation based um, items, I guess you could say. Especially early on, the Godslayer's Seal is a piece of equipment, like um, a weapon you can equip to boost the power of any um, black flame incantations you use. And the Godskin Prayer Book will allow you to have two Black Flame spells. The first one is the Black Fireball. It works like a, a regular Fireball, but it also comes with the addition of doing burn damage afterwards. So they will slowly tick down some health afterwards, allowing you to get like an extra... Uh, from what I noticed on my um, incantation character, that it would do about 50 damage extra minimum. Obviously, certain bosses will have certain higher resistances to certain things, so don't expect a equal thing across the board. But yes, and the other one is a god flame, is a black flame um, thing you can put on your weapon. It's another incantation. It will basically allow you a weapon. It won't boost the weapon's damage at all, from what I've noticed, but it will do tick damage after you land hits. So if there are some tankier bosses and they are quite aggressive, it will allow you to do some burn damage over time. Obviously, same with the fireball. Some bosses will be more resistant than others, so you won't notice an even thing across the board. Without any further ado, let's get into how to find them. We'll okay. be starting our little journey at the one. Rampart but Tower, if you want to know where that is, it's in Stormvale Castle. If you continue with the main story, here, you should come uh, across it over there very early on. It's a very a easy place to get to, so don't worry. And what from there, you'll want to head out to the exit, here, which leads the ones to the castle started. wall. We're sprint and from jump there, you should see a stake of America. We're not we going down the castle wall. Try. I want I you to look at the stake, my stake of America, America or whatever it is, just jump as and then as you can look to the right, and, and what you should see is the two slant tiles. And from the two slant tiles, you're going to sprint and jump. You will um, land on a and roof a just below them. Don't worry, you won't take any full damage but, uh, unless you miss, then you'll probably we're die. To, we're gonna want and to I've to landed it every single time, even die, my first attempt. Uh, when when I didn't anything. know what I was doing, so it's and really easy to not worry. Again. From there, you want to hop down onto cautious, another small roof. Now be cautious. There is another and little inner wall, I don't believe and if you land on there, you are going to start from the rats. beginning, back in the rampart tower. No, no, Not a huge issue, but there is a minor one, it may cause you a is minor that issue. Then no problem, from that little the roof you just landed on, you have to hop down again onto the dirt. If you get stuck in the middle of them, you'll see some stairs down to a basement. Where you want to go now is down those stairs, surprise, surprise. But be cautious, in that room there is around four or five rats. They're not exactly dangerous, okay, it's just they apart. can stun lock you if they surround you, so please be cautious and do you not get yourself killed. And you will need a stone a sword key. Um, Probably should have mentioned that earlier, but you'll need so a stone sword key. Back. You can because again. you'll be going to the imp Obviously, statue, come over inserting here, the stone key the into its head, and then you will find two chests. One will have the God Slayer seal, the seal other one will have the God Skin Prayer Book. And, and two chests. in order to get the spells from the prayer book, the... if you don't know how to do this, yes, the you will want to head over to either the, the brother guy, the in incantation guy in the they round table hold, or you will head to now the giant the turtle in God the church of vows, and you will hand them the prayer book. Be warned though, if you hand a prayer book to the turtle, you can't hand it to the guy in the round table hold because you have already gotten rid of the item and the other guy knows the spells. So if you gave the god skin to the brother in the round table hold, but then you gave, I don't know, the giant's fireball one or whatever it's called to the turtle, the brother can't learn the fireball moves from the giant's book and the turtle can't lose the learn the spells from the god skin book. So keep that in mind, if you're going to pick someone to um, teach you incantations, make sure you stick with that person for most of the spell books. Um, and that's pretty much it. What these spells do is there are two that comes with it. There is a black flame fireball. This is like a regular fireball incantation, but it has the additional effect of burn damage. It will tick for a certain amount after, but please be warned, uh, different bosses can have different levels of resistance. So, some will take more damage, some will take less. Please keep that in mind. The other one, the other spell, is a 
I guess, effect um, thing where you basically um, put black flames on your sword and then whenever you hit an enemy they will tick for about two to three seconds afterwards with um, flame damage. It's great for when you're having to deal with big tanky bosses who are very aggressive and will attack non-stop because it allows you to step away for a couple of seconds and just watch the health tick down. But please be warned, it will not be viable for every single boss. So don't think these will be your uh, ticket to an instant win but they are amazing especially early on because I use them a lot and they were a great help. I hope you enjoyed this guide if you did please like and subscribe many more will be coming to this channel and I shall see you in the next one goodbye.